Up until a couple of years ago, I was very anti the idea of creating a budget because A, who has the time? And B, I know what I'm spending. But when I actually decided to sit down and evaluate my finances, I realized how inconsistent I was being with my spending and by extension, my saving. Creating a budget is a great way to get a big picture snapshot of your finances so you can save for big purchases or just make better decisions about where your money goes. And with the slew of budgeting apps on the market now, it really isn't very hard to create a budget for yourself. Let's take a look at six of the best budgeting apps available right now. Hey y'all, I'm Nikita and welcome back to Nerd Wallet. There are a few different budgeting strategies, so we've been sure to make sure the list covers a couple of the more popular ones. And apps aren't the only way to do a budget, obviously, but they can be more convenient and easier to set up than some more traditional methods. They also do a good job of giving you a clear snapshot of your finances. Typically, budgeting apps will sync with your financial accounts in order to categorize your expenses and track your spending. If you don't want that, I'm including a couple of apps that don't require you to sync your accounts. All the apps I'll mention are fan favorites on the iOS app and Google Play stores. As of July 28, 2022, each one had at least 4.5 out of 5 stars, with at least 1,000 reviews. First up on the list is Mint. I'm mentioning it first because it is the most reviewed app on the list and has very high ratings. It's free, which is always a plus, and syncs to a lot of different types of financial accounts. Mint will track your expenses and place them in budget categories, which you can personalize. You'll set limits for the different categories and Mint will alert you once you are approaching those limits. Mint is a great budgeting platform if you're looking to save money, pay down debt, and track your goals. It handles essentially everything for you, making it a great low maintenance budgeting app option. But if you're looking to be a little more hands-on with your money by planning ahead instead of tracking after spending, YNAB might be a bit more your speed. This app follows the zero-based budgeting system and helps you plan ahead for financial decisions by accounting for every dollar you earn. You will connect your financial accounts. When you get paid, you'll tell the app how to allocate funds such as going to expenses, goals, or savings, which can help you be more intentional in your spending. This app is best if you want to play a more active role in the budgeting process. It is currently priced at $14.99 per month or $98.99 per year. But you can start with a free trial to make sure the app is a good fit for you before you commit to a paying plan. Our third budgeting app on the list, Good Budget, is another hands-on app that's less about tracking expenses and more about planning for them. It follows the envelope system, meaning you portion out your monthly income towards specific spending categories. Good Budget is also one of the two apps on the list that doesn't sync to your bank accounts. So you would manually add your account balances, cash amounts, debts, and income, and then assign funds to your envelopes. You'll need to be prepared to manually enter every expense, so diligence will be key to making the most out of this app. There is a free version that you can use to test out the app that offers limited envelopes and accounts, and then you can upgrade to the $8 monthly option if you decide it's a good fit for you, or you could go with the $70 annual option. If you wanna streamline some of your finances, personal capital might be a good choice. This free app is primarily an investment tool, but the app also has features that can help you track your spending. You can connect your financial accounts, including your IRAs, 401ks, and loans. You can customize the app to show you what percentage of your income is being spent on various customizable categories. It's not the best choice if you want a more detailed view of your spending and savings, but you will have access to a portfolio and net worth tracker, among other investment tools. And if you're investing with a partner, Honeydew is a great option for the two of you. This app is designed to allow you and your partner to see your financial picture in one app. So you can both sync your financial accounts, including your loans and investments. And don't worry, you can choose how much information you'd like to share with your significant other. The app is free and will automatically categorize your expenses. You and your partner can set up limits and customize the categories. And the app will alert you when either of you is approaching the limit. You can also set up bill reminders and chat in the app with your partner. 
And the last app I want to mention is Fudget, <laughs> partly just because it's fun to say, but mostly because it's a great choice if you want something simple, straightforward, and don't want to sync your financial accounts. With Fudget, you will make lists of your expenses and income to track your money. There are no categories and you'll need to log every expense, but the calculator-like interface can give a clear snapshot of your money if you're consistent in logging in your expenses. The app is free with the option to purchase an upgrade for a one-time fee of $3.99. This gives you the ability to export your budget among some other upgraded features. Before we wrap up, I do wanna add that the free Nerd Wallet app lets you track your cash, see your net worth and debt, and track your credit score. But we chose not to include ourselves in the list in order to be sure we gave you guys a unbiased view. I realized when I was choosing a budgeting platform for myself, that being honest with yourself about your goals, but also about how diligent you'll be with logging your expenses is the key to making a decision that you will actually benefit from in the long run. Creating a budget for yourself really can be beneficial in organizing yourself and getting a big picture look at your finances. And choosing a budgeting app that fits with your lifestyle and gives you the snapshot of your finances that you want should be the ultimate goal. I'm currently in the process of saving to buy my first home, so I've been all about that strict budget life the last few months, which goes against just everything my little heart desires. I really just want to spend whatever I want and just have the money magically work itself out. <sighs> but alas, adulthood just doesn't work that way.